The Dow drops 77 points. My name's D7 here at Grok Trade. Kicking off the week here Monday, July 25th, 2016. Out of all indexes, only NASDAQ was at break even. Everybody else in negative territory. And we have crude oil. I want to draw your attention to this. 2.8% down. Uh, crude futures of, is, is... Hits its three-month low. Gold off is 0.7%. Same for silver. The VIX, though, is uh, down 0.5%. But the VIX index, the index, is up 11%. Big run here on the VIX index. Here we are looking at the spider. This is the daily chart. We go higher, 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 higher. And we're just chopping sideways, 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 sideways. A lot of just frustrating movement no, nothing happening here we want big rally to the upside or a big rally or drop to the downside give us movement we're done with this sideways nothing movement this is boring it's hard to make money in this unless you're day trading even with these small candlesticks it's hard to make money with these tiny tiny candlesticks we want big big moves in the market um, day trading, you can make sizably more money on big moves opposed to these teeny itsy bitsy candlesticks. We do have a chat room. If you go to grocktrade.com, you can uh, you see that we have a chat room, 30 days free if you want to try it out. It's morning hours trading. If you look here at the NASDAQ, uh, we did squeak out a bullish day. We continue to slightly go higher, but man, guys, this looks very toppy to me. Look how extended we are. Follow my cursor here. Up, 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 up. Little stagger step. And then up, 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 up. It is very extended. This market is begging for a pullback. Russell's sideways, 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 but this is a high base formation, much more bullish than it is bearish. As long as we can stay sideways and then get a pop with big volume, that would be ideal. I'm going to go here to crude oil and show you this. We looked at this crude oil as being a just a big bullish uh, falling wedge here. Thinking, man, we could get a pop. I was almost tempted to put a bicycle in there, but I said I'm going to not do that yet. And sure enough, we come crashing down. This market is in trouble, trouble, trouble. So I would not want to touch this with a 10-foot pole. Get rid of some of these lines that don't matter anymore. And anyway, I might probably get rid of that one too. Just dealing with these for the time being. But wow, that is problematic. Gold. This is bad news. I'm going to reverse my call now. Now that we broke this area of support, that, that now is a bearish call. We're on the wrong side of the support level. We went long. That was short-lived. Now turn around and doing a short here. Silver. Silver, though is man i'm not there's no way i'm calling that a sell yet this is definitely buy territory for silver so wow we're within a quandary oh boy it'd be interesting to see what tuesday holds for us here in silver and gold because silver looks like it's ready to pop here right on a great foundation a nice support level let's see if that actually happens if you go to grok trade we have a mentorship coming up to learn about that. Click on Trading Mentor and make sure you get the 101 trading videos. They're yours there. Then you can also download them if you want to. But fill out the form here on the mentor page. We do trading videos on a daily basis. Amiricat does them on a sp more sporadic basis. If you like it, like it. 